I don't deserve to sleep indoors. You're like, what? Of course you do, Liberty. Oh, we're so sad. You're such a victim. You should sleep indoors. Well, I'm tired of hearing that shit, but you know, I mean, of course. Yeah, everybody deserves to sleep indoors. Everybody deserves to eat. Or or do they? Well, I mean, I'll tell you this much. The Bible says if you don't work, you don't eat. So I'll tell you this. I thank God that I am able to eat every day. Not only that, but healthy. And not only that, but I have a protein shake and a green drink. I'm training for a marathon. Now, here's the thing. Uh, uh, there's a marathon for wealth here in my mind and in my soul but also a real marathon that I'll be running I run every day you know what I mean like I feel like I'm just spanking that spanking that spanking that ass every day for all you employees out there all you employees or, or people that aren't working people that are on disability and you sit at home here's the thing now I sat on my fat ass for for years you know what I mean and like no not I'm not fat now obviously if you've ever known me at all even close to a tiny bit you've known that I will brag about how I lost 200 pounds and yes I was fat fat is fat Gorda is you know what I mean like it's just fat so um yeah, but the fatness in my mind, the selfishness, the greediness, not sharing myself, not opening up, not being transparent, being afraid to hurt other people's feelings. Now that's called insecurity, and that's insecurity. What does that mean? Fear. Fear is the opposite of love. Now, if I'm going out there and talking to people, it, you know, nobody cares. If I even if I say something stupid that makes no sense, or even if I say something that may be offensive, they don't care because as long as I'm talking, they know that I care about them, and and so just because of that. I am winning because I'm out there doing it. You see what I'm saying? I am doing it. I'm doing the damn thing. And I'm going to keep on doing it because I know that I am infinite in value. And guess what? One day the marketplace is going to pay me for that. One day I'm going to get value for all these speeches that I'm doing. For I'm putting in all this time, five years sleeping outside. I'm putting in the work. I'm putting in the work every day, running five, six, seven, eight miles a day, and then walking out here in Rancho Cucamonga, walking seven miles, 10 miles. I walk 20 miles a day in Rancho Cucamonga just so I can get food you know, and, and go to stores that I need to go to and get away from people so I can do this. You know, there's, this is a big place and the buses don't run that much, but I'm going to keep doing it. You know? Yeah. No, I don't deserve to sleep indoors. You know why? Because I don't deserve section eight anymore. I don't deserve poverty. I don't deserve any of those things. So I'm going to put in the work and the time now so the marketplace can see me as valuable so that I can have the place I want. There's a place that I want and it costs $1,900 and there's a pool. It's not the best place, but it's the best place that I want. And I want that place. I've been wanting that place for two years. So it's $1,900. There's a pool. I've seen the indoors of it. It's nice. It's got, it's a real small. It's like I'm starting over in California. Like my, it looks like my very first apartment, except that place didn't have a pool. And this place wasn't right down the street from real, some really nice, uh, health food stores that I go to and also CVS where they always have my kombucha almost every time that I want it you know so I'm gonna I know all the people in Santa Monica I'm gonna get this place it's $1,900 I deserve that place or do I no not yet but I deserve that and a whole lot more and I'm going to deserve more because I'm gonna keep on putting in the work to get the things that I deserve because you if you don't work you don't eat and you don't and so I'm working my face off making up for the past but I'm also putting in an escrow for the future for my private jet for my 1970 boss three to name Maverick. You have to put in the work for the things that you want. You can't sit on your ass and eat Doritos and say that you want to be healthy and lose weight. It doesn't work that way. You can't say that you want a private jet and not work every minute of every day. You don't have free time. You don't have holidays. There's no Memorial Day, Labor Day. There's no Halloween, Christmas, none of that. You work every day. You just keep putting the work in until you get good enough where people recognize your value and you get paid accordingly. You are worth it. So if you want something, put in the work. Don't say that you want it. You deserve something when you have worked for it. That's the point. Okay? No, I don't deserve to sleep indoors. I deserve to have the place that I want because I am infinite in value. And if you want to help me out, I take PayPal. If, if you appreciate me for what I've done, if you value me for what I've done, then send me some PayPal. Any amount, I will be truly grateful for it. And guess what? I deserve to have what I want. That, that apartment is $1,900, but guess what? I need $6,000. I need to start making $6,000 so that I can get that apartment so that if, in case anything happens, I'll have enough so that I could pay the extra rent. So I take PayPal. All right. Do that. I appreciate you. You are infinite value. If you, if you enjoyed this episode, do me a favor and share this with your friends. Make sure you subscribe and comment below. Tell me what your name is. My name is Liberty V Justice. There's no period in my weeks. My victories never end and yours don't have to either champions. You are infinite in value. Thank you.